Hello, gentlemen and fine lady folk. My name is Asterolfus, and let us continue dominating all of Middle Earth, including Isengard, and especially Isengard, as the hobbits with their dreaded, dreaded, razor sharp teeth and their evil, evil, evil small stature in which they could plan and scheme and conquer without even being seen. Anyway, so we last left off. We were done conquering the city of Megalin. And we have a rebel sort of force right next to Bree. The holy city of Bree. A city so clean you can lick the floors and eat the toilets. It's amazing. Not like Hobbiton over there, which is a complete shithole. But Bree. They dare to besiege Bree. We have an army here and we will annihilate them. But first, let's get our bearings. So, in order to conquer Isengard, we need to conquer all four of these rebel bull settlements. And then go down south to Isengard over here. Alright. Is there any settlements after these four settlements on the way to Isengard? Probably. But they're probably friendly, maybe, or orcs of the Mystic Mountains. In which case, they're neutral. So we have neutral and we have um, a bunch of uh, allied settlements, which is good. We could also face off against even more rebels and bandits, but after these four large towns, we won't have to worry about super massive rebel armies going forward, which is awesome. Um, north to us are the Northern Dundanes over here, and north of them would be the Remnants of Agmar, which is our enemy. But we don't have to worry about the Remnants of Agmar because they're fighting the Dundanes, and as long as the Dundanes are in power, then they'll be kind of our buffer shield. It sucks, I know, but who cares about Dundanes? Who cares about Aragorn? Good God, who gives a fuck about him? I never did. I thought Gimli was the coolest one, even though he was kind of like a comic relief in the movies. Um... Let's see if we can see any of the other capitals. We have Barad Dura, which is over here. This would be the Eye of, I of Sauron. But we wouldn't know that. There's Minas Tirith. Um, there's Umbar. And north of that would be Heridium. And to the east of us, to the very east, would be the Easterlings over here. Where's Mirkwood? Come on, can we see Mirkwood? Yeah, there's Dolgador capital. There's the Galdrium capital. There is Mori over there. The Mountain Orcs have a capital over there. So all around, we're doing pretty good. Anyway, let's end our turn. Let's continue our rampage of all of the Shire. No, wait! Northern Dundane, you're supposed to help us with the rebels. No, Dundane. Dundane just done goofed us. Oh, God. Now, I could leave the rebels, like, alone. And sort of just continue conquering other civilizations. But you know what? We might as well kill them for EXP and also because they could get the drop on us. Which is really bad. Anyway, reinforced region. Construction report. Chicken farms. Chicken farms for all my people so they may feast upon the eggs and the meat of the chickens. Good. Good. You know what, while we're on that subject, I need you to build a chicken farm as well as a smoking house. Chicken farm to grow out the civilization, I mean the city, and to get more population. And smoking house just so that we can get some diplomats so I can scout my western borders because I have no idea what the fuck is over here. Anyway, army. Yes, my lord. Let's go and smash these rebels. They Must thought they can hide in the forest. We march into battle. <sighs> they thought they can hide, but for now they will die. For long, if he willed, he could still appear noble and beautiful, so as to deceive all but the most wary about Sauron, the rings of power, and of and the Dirt Age. Anyway, let's back out my guys over here, so that they don't get ambushed by rebels. Now, where are the rebels? Oh, there they are. Now, let's end this battle quick, because I have some pizza to get. Let's station the archers over here. We'll have the spearmen in front of them. Archers need to get out of skirmish mode because they're going to be very close to the battle. Alright, here comes the bandits and the rebels. Are these humans or are these hobbits? Yeah, I think they're hobbits. Okay, bombard them. Bombard them, my archers. Get ready. Fire. Good. Good shit. Here comes the pelting. Aha. We will destroy them before they ever come here. Now, 
Frodo Baggins is going to put some hurt down on these fuckers. Where is Frodo actually? Oh my god, I can't see Frodo here. That's weird. Yeah, you better back off. Back off from my archers. Oh, they're actually going to attack my spearmen. Alright. Let's attack these guys right now. We'll go for the uh, bandits and rebels that are attacking us at the sides. This guy in the middle over here is just going to get pelted by my archers to death because... Why not? Yeah, 19 guys. Just doing good route. Yep, they routed. Okay, good. Now the archers can go and support. Oh, they routed too. Okay, um... Only half the enemy force we just killed the general already. Shit, man. Um... Oh, this, this battle is going very well, actually. Unfortunately, the hobbitry are in arms are actually losing some forces. Keep fighting, keep fighting. The enemy army awed by wow, we only lost 32 we men. That was a really fast battle. And this is first-rate salted pork. Or I can cut you some rashers of bacon and I broil them if you like. Okay, rebels are dead. Good. In front of the just, we'll go to Bree. Your orders, my and we'll bring some forces over here to Bray as well, just so that we can get a huge army going. Let's bring the Harbour in arms to Megalin, so that we can get somebody to defend it. And then change the growth policy to, I mean the build policy to growth, so that the city doesn't take a ton of uh, really, really bad sort of uh, public order hits. And we can also get some Breland Militia retrained, which is good. Then afterwards, we can get the Archer Militia retrained. You know what? Let's take this guy. Yes. Uh, let's go east with him, because I want to get a watchtower. With honor. Yes. Yeah, right over here. This tower will keep vigil over the lands. Yeah, that's good. We might want to get a watchtower over here. Maybe over here. In fact, I might do that with Lord, this guy. Lord. Good. Yes, my Lord. Let's build a watchtower. This tower will keep vigil nice. over the lands. Nice. And you know what? I'm going to go With west honor, afterwards and we can go no build a watchtower over here and then we should be done. And then we'll send him back to Bree. Your orders, my lord. Your orders, my lord. Okay, recruitment-wise, three turns to axemen, one turn to swordmen. Pretty good. Pretty good stuff. All right, end the turn. Now, these watchtowers are only going to be made to sort of see where the rebels are, because we need to know when the rebels are coming at us or not. Also, just in case the Norver Dundanes fail, these will be kind of like a last resort against the remnants of Agmar that could conquer Norver Dundane. Agmar, Agmar, Agmar. Okay, and turn, construction complete, recruitment complete, and relations worsened with the clans of Endwraith. Hmm, uh, something tells me I don't give a damn about them. Let's retrain these bozos. Yes, my lord. And you're going yes. west. Construct the tower here. This tower there we go. Vigil over the lands. With your orders, my we lord. can go to that city and get not very high tax rate. Just go to normal tax rate. What is wrong with you hobbits, you greedy little fucks? Always asking people for money. Oh, can you give me like 5,000 shillings? Good god. Shove them up my asshole, and then like shit them out after I go to the toilet for like five hours trying to grab them from my small intestine. Why did they stop there? Hmm. Are there rebels there? Better not be rebels there. I'll smash them. Gentlemen! And lady folk, we have suffered a terrible, terrible, terrible crash. One of which dreaded to destroy all of our let's play, but it is okay. We have survived it, and now we will drive. We'll drive once again. God damn it, I forgot to press space. Well, there goes the Northern Dundanes moving their forces back and forth, back and forth. I don't know what they're doing, what they're planning. Maybe they're trying to get forces to the front line so that they can fight the remnants of Agmar. What are you still doing here, or dwarves? What are you doing? I almost said orves. <laughs> like orcs and a dwarf combined. Imagine a dwarf and a orc fucking each other. Ugh, the combination. 
Dol Amroth claims Ed Helond. Long has Ed Helond remained untouched, unspoiled, and unpopulated since the elves left long ago. From Gondor, the port city has been abandoned. Its large docks and strong walls have remained unused, and the surrounding lands empty. Times are changing, however. Gondor faces war from the east, the south, and possibly the north. It cannot afford to waste land, and thus, the Prince of Dol Amroth has now sent the force to occupy the city and kept it fortified. Ed Helond now belongs to the Prince. Longed a gallon sacked. This war is continuing. The Shadow of Mordor hates us now. For God knows what reason. We have the uh, Sword Militia here. Pretty good unit. We're gonna wait one more turn till we get these guys for train, as well as getting the Watchman Axe Guard. That should be it. And you're gonna go to Bree. That's good. And once you're in Bree, now I can move out Frodo. Oh, there's their uh, fortress over there to the east of us. That's good. All right, now. There we go. Bandits and rebels. And ooh, bride presented. Betrothed from the just and Trudy, a young woman of fitting breeding and station, has been discovered as a potential partner for this man. Yes, fitting breeding. She has boobs the size of a mumakil and the ass the size of all of Gondor. Would you like for the wedding arrangements to be organized now? Oh, yes. Uh, Isengard fights the Kingdom of Rohan. That could either be really bad or really, really good. Done letting see us. Well, I've never seen them in my entire life. Okay, Axeman Regiment. And afterwards, we're going to get a spy. We're going to go down south I would and scout out the surrounding area. They were my own friend. Love this song. Like, da, na, na, na. It's like epically. Like, yes, we're on a journey. Let's go and conquer. Alright, um, we have 779 gold per turn. That's good. Uh, all the other cities are doing very, very well. Let's end our turn. And then afterwards we will march south. I don't have any watchtowers west, but I think that's okay. For now we have to just check our borders west. And if there's like just dwarves west and we're just allies with them, then you know what? That's good. Lebanon under siege. Oh. North Ilian attacked. South Ilian reclaimed. Aragon reclamation fails since the days of the wars of the elves and Sauron. The lands of Aragon and its capital city, Ost in Edil, have been left abandoned since its spoiling life has returned to the surrounding lands. Trees regrow and the surrounding nations prosper. Lord of Embladis finally decided to attempt to retake the ruins of the city to protect it against orcs and men. Despite the valor and strength of the elves, the thought has failed. Aragon now remains in the hands of others. Over Dunday likes us, that's good. And you know what? You're all we have a diplomat. Give me a spy. Let's send him down south. I shall continue tomorrow. Okay. Good. We now I have an army. Let's move down over here. And while we're on that subject, you guys can go east. And we're all gonna meet up, which is good. Yes, my lord. We have an axe guard regiment as well as a sword guard regiment. Oh no, just a Watchman Sword Regiment. Uh, what's the difference between the two? Oh, this one is better at, I guess, Cavalry. Cavalry and Armor. Alright, that's good. Good enough. We'll use them against Heavy Infantry. Chicken Farming is almost done. After the Practice Range, let's get Crop Rotation for you. And then afterwards, we'll get the Stables. Should be good. Kingdom of Rohan, haha. <laughs> Northern Dundane, hello there. Kingdom of Dale, Dwarves of Ered Loon. You are continuing to basically stalk my city, not leave. I beseech you to leave, as you are creeping out, my folks, still. But you're, you're welcome to stay if you want. Is that a wine glass right next to my city over there? Yeah, that is a wine glass. 
Just giant wine glass that towers over my city, apparently. Okay, construction report. That's good. Your order, my lord. Yes, my lord. And let's all meet up. Assembling a mighty host. Oh, and we can recruit some mercenaries, but I don't think I will. Let's see what's over here. A couple of spear militia, a couple of peasant archers. Peasant archers have... How much damage do they have? Okay, let's try to enter. Good... What? Try to go into a city and we die. Okay, so that was a little bit of a shame, but we lost our spy. But don't worry, we can get another one. It's like a two-for-one deal. Why do you have a very high tax rate? Ooh. Let's get normal for you. Your attention so that you can grow and... You know, you can also, like, I guess, give us a lot of money. Alright, so the spy didn't work out, so I don't know how much damage the peasant archers do. But I know the peasant swordsmen must suck. They must. They can't be awesome. They can't be amazing. They can't be spectacular. They must suck. Suck, suck, suck. Suck giant testicles. Like, as big as Sauron's eyeball. God, can you imagine the testicles on Sauron? Ooh. <laughs> it's weird. Okay, Bride has been presented to Councilman Andrew. Haha, -ha, everybody's gonna get hitched tonight. Mission failed, but I didn't care. Grey Haven's a Linden, good. How do I check my family tree, by the way? Um, I would like to- Ah, there it is. We have a son named- Oh, he has a son named Edgar. Oh, no, 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 these are- all of his sons. Bitch is like 44. What? Alright. Let Lord, us my Lord. move down. To battle. And that should be it. We have an agent here, right? Yes, we do. Another agent. So, how about you move down? Oh, why did you go that way? Oh, whatever. I want him to move down to Isengard, actually. Oh, now we get to see Isengard. Anyway, we're going to move him down to Isengard so that we can see all of the settlements that we have to pass before we uh, basically, you know, march on to Isengard itself. I wonder, if we attack Isengard, does that mean we're at war with everybody else? That's pretty cool. Alright, one more sword regiment, and then afterwards we'll get two more units. So we're just constantly making more units and more units. It's really splendid. Wait, how many, how many turns till our boar is finished? Five turns. Okay, so we can build the units. Kingdom of Dale, Dwarves of Erebor, and Iron Hills. Drandal's Realm. The Shadow of Mordor. Works of the Missing Mountains, Remnants of Agmar. Haven of Umbar. Hello there, Umbar. How are you doing, Umbar? I think you're doing really good. And faction announcements, coming of age, blah, blah, blah. Recruitment report and diplomatic information. Easterlings and Vale of Dorwinian are at war with each other. And a Vale of Anduin are now at allies with the elves over here. Good for you. Yes. Was that your best shot? Huh. I have nothing to They're say. They're attacking to you. us apparently, Stop. but Your order. I don't care about that. As you come We're going to get we some siege towers and ladders and stuff like that. Time to build. One turn. Good. Let's get like real siege towers. No, 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 no. Not siege towers. Let's get th four ladders, one siege tower, one um ram. It'll take yes. one turn to make them all, which is good. And you know what, I'm going to extend this part to a longer time frame because I feel as though that crash did fuck me up a little bit. Ah, there's a rebel encampment, okay. Right over there. It's away from Isengard, but at the same time, maybe we should conquer it. We do have to get rid of these rebels, so we might make a detour and conquer that city, actually. Or maybe we'll let Northern Dundane conquer it. Actually, no, wait. We'll conquer it, definitely. Good God. Stop getting hitched, my friends. Stop it. The mission. Reinforced region. I don't care. 
Yes. Okay, let us now attack. Assault the city. Assault. Mm, Ten to seven. Don't like those odds. Let's attack. There is no knowing what a dwarf will not dare and do for revenge or the recovery of his own. The Hobbit. Oh god, the Nazgul with the ring wraith over here. Oh, it's so cool. This is a cool picture. I love the guys who do the artwork. Oh god. Can I just get wallpapers of all this shit? I would love that. Anyway. Yep. Um, uh, Mr. Sword Regiment will be over here. With the watchtower, that's good. I mean, the siege tower. Archers shouldn't be over here. In fact, let's get the... Lumbermen? No, the Lumbermen do a decent amount of damage. Be the weakest unit. Yeah, let's get the Breland Militia. The various ladders will go to various people. I think actually the Spreeland Militia should drop his ladder and we should have the lumber men actually take it. Oh, where's where's that ladder? Oh, it's over there. So you guys can grab it. We need, you to, we need to place you guys on different positions actually. Place a unit over here. Then we'll place a unit over here. That's basically it. We'll have the siege tower support this ladder as well as um, the battering ram. Archers will support the main assault force. And all other units can kind of just chill out. I'm going to put another unit actually over here. Anyway, let's start the battle. Take it. Scale them. And now you can scale the walls and you can scale the walls. No, 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 wait, wait. You scale the walls, scale that wall. You can get the um, gates and you can attack those walls. All right, good. Now our archers will be on the ground floor, sort of supporting our infantry. In fact, let's see. Yep, these are peasant archers over here, as well as another spear militia over here. So, you know what? Focus all of our fire here. Let's kill these peasant archers. But our own archers. Oh, they will rue the day they face off against the hobbits. The hobbits are coming. We're taking the Hobbit's to Isengard after all. Okay, men. Get ready. Unleash hell! Hell! This isn't what I had in mind. Oh, there we go. There's hell. The ladders are now in place. Walls are no match for the valor and force of our arms. Okay, they're running away from our Breland Militia here. Archers are continuing to put the hurt down. How's it going over here on this side? Ah, oh, you're, you're making your way. Yes, come on, keep. Keep firing your arrows. The swordsmen are here. Oh no, those are Breland Militia. Okay. Regardless though, the battle begins. Men have reached the gate with a battering ram. Yes, yes, keep attacking, good. Here comes the axe guard. Our siege towers have reached the walls. Excellent. The Excellent. Excellent. Go, swordsman, go, 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 go. Okay, we're attacking them on multiple sides. They can't handle this. Uh-oh. 
what? Here comes the fuzz. Come on, swordsman, go! If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Battles are still continuing over here. The Breland militia are conquering, killing all that stand before them. Our men have done well. The gates have fallen. Aha, the gates are now ours. Okay, archers, I'm going to have to ask you to actually change your targets. Their worth today. The enemy's walls belong to us now. And I'm going to have to ask you to attack that sword militia over there. Because right now it seems like we're winning on all fronts. Like, no, no, wait. Let's fire on these bandits and rebels over here. Stam archers. 30 archers. Alright, and where's that sword militia that was here? He was, he was here. Yeah, there he is. Go attack him. Chase after him, my man. Chase after him. Go, 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 go. We little hobbits, they said. We little hobbits, they said. Now they'll know pain. Now they'll know suffering. Why are these hobbits as tall as these men? Or are they men at all? Hmm, they might be actually other hobbits. Okay, they've routed, good. Well, we don't have much use for these archers, actually. Well, I guess that's what happens when you kick too much ass. Hmm, they're blocking the paths. But that's not gonna help them. Apparently the bandits wanna fight here, the peasant archers. Excuse me, peasant archers, but you're facing off against sword militia. Okay, again, I gotta find that sword miss, uh, master. There he is. Fight him. Only half the enemy force remains. Half? Wow, that's way too much. We gotta make sure they're cut down. Okay, Breland Militia, can you guys attack these spear militia that are behind my swordsmen? I want the swordsman to actually attack this other swordsman militia over here. Really? Defeat some surge? Oh well, let's turn around and attack them. Three distinct possibility. Are you serious? We're gonna win. Let's be honest. How are you doing over here? Well, whatever you were fighting is dead, I guess. How is defeat certain? Okay, now what? Now only a fool can lose this battle? What? These people are so indecisive. It's because they're very tired. And they're very, very tired. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. I need Frodo to get over here so that he can rally these guys. Run this boy over. Let's crank it up to speed six. Yep, now they're dead. Good. Alright, now then. Fight! Kill him. Kill him. Go! Go, Breland! Militia, go! The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours.
Alright, the archers should be able to annihilate this sword militia over here. Yep. Three. Two. Wow, they're still living. They're still alive. Briefing. That's a little bit bad. Hope I don't lose too many forces. We're already 30 men on our sword regiment here. Wow, that sucks. Okay. We've lost control of the city. Good time. It's ours. The enemy it's ours. Lies dead. Yeah, fuck you, enemy general. You're dead now, bitch. Can we get the archers to like pull back? I guess. Go back. I think they're causing more damage than good. This is a clear. All right, victory. we won. Yay! 182 guys lost. That's not that bad. The arrows have been unveiling. I guess the Numerian armor, the great men toward above the tall orcs and their spears and and swords far outreach the weapons of their enemies. Glory. Okay, let's occupy the settlement. Afterwards, we can probably get hmm. I kind of want to get a bowry so I can upgrade these. I mean, uh, retrain these guys. Be a town watch? Is there a town watch? Yeah, there's a town watch. I'm going to have to wait till I can get the town watch actually. Because that seems to be very important. So we're going to take a pit stop here. First, Ooh, what I is this? Your then your lives. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit strange, because we're going to have to deal with these guys now. Oh, but we have an army here. Your orders, my lord. I'm trying to deal with him. Two to one. Ah, we shouldn't lose too much. Ah, uh, 22 men lost. We killed him. That's good. He had blue skin. He looked an like a reject. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. And what, there's another one now? Seriously? I uh, resolve. 52 now, what? Okay, that's, that, that was insane. Okay. Tw I thought 23 was insane, but 52? Good God. Yes. Oh well. We'll bring our forces back in the train. Anyway, so. I think that's it. Um, thank you guys for watching, and I'm going to end this part here, and bye-bye.